Welcome back to another video guys, Karko here and today we're going to be cleaning up the uh, Mark 6 ZTEC S for one reason and that is because the car is going to be sold. Um, it's up for sale now, um, I've had a few people call up but not really matching the price that I want but they're on hold at the moment. But I want to keep the car clean in mint top condition as always. So these are the three products that I'm going to use. I'm having to use, I know it's a bit of a crap product, having to use a demon phone. Uh, snow foam to use just because of the pure fact that uh, my jet wash what's over there had decided to pack up on me um, It's not performing any power not it's going back. It's being repaired, but I'm gonna send it back and probably get a better one um, So I'm having to use a demon foam one what's gonna not be as good, but you know guys it does the job Here as I've just sprayed onto my car just now I put some auto glim wheel cleaner on there So just try and lift off some of that dirt and I'm just gonna go around with just a, a wheel brush to do that the um, shampoo and conditioner that I'm using for the uh, wash today is the Meguiar's Gold Class. Um, we're also going to be using a few other little products, you know, just um, just little things to finish it off. So we're going to use some wheel protection cleaner and stuff. But I'll show you that at a shorter, well, you know, show you that a bit further on in the video. So today we're just using some uh, mitts that I've got. These are the new ones. Be really cool, nice, soft on the car. No, don't lose any scratches. So what I'm going to do first is spray on this demon foam and then clean the wheels and lift the dirt off and we'll get cracking on with it. So what we've done here is that we've just literally just snow foamed it. As you can see most of it is run off now. I've left it for like five minutes or so just to try and pull off some of the crap that's on the car like stuck to it or see it's winter and it's you're gonna get all horrible muck on your car as you can see all there it's all horrible it's not looking good so what we're gonna do is go to these wheels we're gonna give them a good old brush just to try and lift the dirt as you can see it lift, lifts it off go around again with a sponge rinse them off and it should make them look a bit nicer then we'll concentrate on the bodywork Now I don't normally use a sponge, but um, today I have just to use on the wheels. It's not definitely not touching the bodywork, but look how disgusting that is. I think that is going to go straight in the bin. That is disgusting, just all from crap off your wheels. So today we're going to be using a two bucket method, what you should always do when cleaning the car. In this bucket we've got the Meguiar's Gold Class, with um, just my sponge in there, just soaking up some of the uh, moisture. And then here we've just got an empty bucket with warm water in it, just to rinse down the sponge or well the actual cloth itself after uh, we're not putting dirt back on the car trying to turn these bubbles off it's surprising how dirty your hands get just from washing some wheels but yeah let's crack on so what i've done here this is after all the shampoo has been rinsed off i didn't really get much film footage um for me actually washing the car with the mitt and stuff like that just the pure fact that it did turn really really dull so I kind of wanted just to concentrate, get it done before it actually starts raining. So as you can see, I've just rinsed it all off. As you can see, it's very wet still. So what I'm going to do is use the Meguiar's drying towel, give it a good dry, and then I'll be back. So that is the wash complete. This has not been a video of any type of how to wash a car or anything like that at all. This is just me doing a video telling you that the Mark 6 is for sale with a sad face, but I can't believe what we're getting for a replacement. I'm not announcing what it is, because I am going to be making a video of me picking up a new car. It is going to be quite a few weeks away, well, probably just under a month away. Um, so do hang on, you know, bear with me for that video. It's not going to be like in the next week or so, it will be a little while. But guys, what I've done at the end, I've uh, added a few little, you know, a few little clips of my car after it's been washed, looking lovely. And all good stuff. So this will be the probably last time you see me use the um, wheel brush and stuff like that. the stuff like that. Because I'm going to get all new equipment, um, products. I'm still going to stay the same, obviously with Meguiar's or a Glim, um, all stuff like that. So we're going to skip with those sort of products, but we're not using the crappy demon stuff because that's not very good anymore. It used to be good until these ones were released, but these ones have overpowered them massively. But like I say, but like your sponges, your wheel cleaners, uh, wheel brushes and stuff like that. I'm going to be getting all new equipment for the new car because this is going to need some looking after so guys like i say please sure give it a thumbs up hope you enjoyed the clips that i'm playing next and i'll see you guys in my next video
for sure we'll be sad to see this car go it's been great fun um it's not actually sold at the moment but it is going to be sold within a few weeks hopefully fingers crossed like i say it will be sad to see this car go it's been great fun I've had great good memories in here and yeah it was a dream but you know on to bigger and better things so thanks for watching guys and i'll see you in the next video